Our center was one of the study sites for the hybrid L24 cochlear implant system, which resulted in the world's first FDA-approved solution for ski slope hearing losses. The hybrid system combines the electric and the acoustic aspects of hearing to provide not only sound clarity, but also the quality of sound, the fullness and richness of sound. The hybrid cochlear implant has opened the door for many people with a unique ski slope hearing loss. They get the best of both worlds, their natural acoustic hearing and the cochlear implant sound. The goal of the hybrid is to give the patient those high pitch sounds that they can't get from a traditional hearing aid. By inserting the electrode and replacing the sound from the high pitch part of the cochlea and potentially preserving the low pitched natural hearing in the cochlea, the patient can use a processor which gives them the high pitches through the cochlear implant and the low pitches through a hearing aid or acoustic component that's combined together in one device. Traditional cochlear implant candidacy criteria is based on sentence understanding. However, patients with a ski slope hearing loss are often good guessers. If they get one or two words, they can fill in the blanks based on the context of the sentence. But if you measure their ability to understand single words, that's where they really fall apart. The hybrid implant system is the first device to use individual words as the indication as opposed to sentences. So more people qualify for this device. Patients always come into the clinic reporting their struggle with hearing out in the real world, but they don't always qualify for a cochlear implant. With the hybrid cochlear implant, I think that indications are finally catching up with patients' needs. Having the hybrid as an option gives us all of the tools we need to treat that patient for whatever their needs may be. This is a very exciting time for, for me as a clinician in the cochlear implant industry because of the hybrid technology and the ability to combine electrical and acoustical information. These are patients with fairly good low frequency hearing, but not good high frequency hearing. Uh, so a, a hearing aid cannot give them enough benefit in the high frequencies to give them good word understanding. Uh, so to be able to offer them this hybrid technology now, uh, I think is, is huge. Uh, we'll be able to help patients that have been in this gray area of frustration where they've not been able to get a traditional implant, uh, but not benefiting from their traditional hearing aids. I saw a recent patient that's a, a minister and he had to give up his profession because he was not able to speak to his, um, his uh, people in his church. And after his hybrid cochlear implant, he, he's back to working full time, able to communicate with them, uh, not missing the subtleties uh, that he was uh, relying on speech uh, or lip reading to get in the past. No one needs to struggle with their hearing loss anymore. Hearing aid technology has come so far. The hybrid implant is a bridge between hearing aids and cochlear implants, and traditional cochlear implants are a proven solution to restore hearing.